As reported by Pucara Defensa, the Brazilian Army's High Command recently saw the first prototype of the modernized EE-9 Cascavel armored reconnaissance vehicle, known as the 6x6 EE-9M Cascavel, VBRMSR, P01. The initiative, overseen by the Manufacturing Directorate, DF, and won by the Consortium Forza Terrestre, Acre, Opto, and Universal, encompasses the development of the project, construction of two prototypes, and a pilot batch comprising seven vehicles. However, this marks just the initial phase of a broader program aimed at modernizing between 98 and 201 vehicles out of the current 409 in the Brazilian Army's inventory. The condition is that the final cost does not exceed 30% of the value of a Centauro II. The construction phases of the prototype of the Sao Paulo War Arsenal AGSP, hint at a meticulous process. While the P-01 is set for an official press unveiling later this month at AGSP, the second prototype, anticipated for the next semester, will be equipped with anti-tank guided missiles ATGM, potentially the Spike LR. In addition to these developments, notable aspect of the modernization is the incorporation of a new gunner's sight, a commander's independent thermal viewer, CITV, and a driver's camera. It's noteworthy that the first prototype lacks the anti-tank missile launcher, an element likely to be integrated into subsequent iterations. This effort is not an isolated occurrence but part of a broader initiative launched by the Brazilian Army in March 2021 to modernize its entire fleet of EE-9 Cascavel 6x6 armored vehicles. The plan outlines the modernization of 98 to 201 vehicles over an eight-year period. Key elements of this initiative include the integration of a new firing control system, a ballistic computer, and an electric turret rotation system controllable by the commander. However, no enhancements to the existing armor are stipulated in the upgrade package. Several defense companies have expressed interest in contributing to this modernization program. Notable contenders include Rainmetal in collaboration with Brazilian company Equitron and Elbit Systems from Israel in partnership with Ares. The EE-9 Cascavel, originally developed by Brazilian company Ingenza, has been an integral part of the Brazilian Army since its serial production commenced in 1974. The EE-9 Cascavel, built on a 6x6 truck chassis, is fitted with a two-man turret armed with a 90mm cannon. Its versatility is demonstrated through its ability to fire various rounds, including HE, heat, HESH, smoke white phosphorus, and heat target practice. The vehicle's power source is a Detroit diesel 6V-53N six-cylinder water-cooled diesel engine, offering a maximum road speed of 100 km per hour and a cruising range of 880 km.